He loves to give love and he loves to absorb love. <laughs> He's just fluffy and mushy and squishy. I call him a love sponge. <laughs> I'm Dolly and this is a story about Wendell or Geo Beats. Growing up on a farm, it just kind of came naturally to me to want to be around animals. Once my grandparents passed away and my mother moved to Korea, I just sort of felt a void. I just thought, well, I have a big, beautiful farm to share. I was really interested in parrots at first and it just started from there, really. Now I have a big variety of rescued animals. <laughs> With the possums, I was always kind of afraid of them. Wendell was just a big surprise. I was outside just doing some yard work and I looked down, he was probably maybe two inches at the time, just laying there kind of on his side. I thought he was a rat at first. He was not looking well. And then later on in the day, I saw the same. We never saw the mom. My heart said, he needs help. I called a local rehabber and she said, we cannot take any more animals. We're totally full. And and I said, well, okay, I guess that's going to be up to me then to save this little guy's life. She gave me some pointers. And from there, I just started doing research and trying to find other people and other rehabbers that could guide me. Luckily, I did come across so many helpful people. And now that little guy is close to 16 and a half pounds. <laughs> Isn't he adorable? Yes. <laughs> I scratch Wendell, and Wendell scratches Winnie. <laughs> I don't know that I ever wanted a possum, but now I think, how will I ever live without them? <laughs> They're not on your schedule, you're on their schedule. It's constant feeding and constantly having to help them to go to the bathroom. Great package in the mail. And there's so many people that are scrutinizing you. If you have your stuff on social media, people are always watching for the tiniest little thing you're doing wrong. It took me a while to get used to it, but it was so worth it. They have a huge mouth with 50 teeth in them. Their tail, they use that just like another leg or arm to hold on to things. Hello. In my mind, I think they know and recognize recognize their names. Wendell, he's extremely affectionate. I think he's a living teddy bear. Meet Wendell, definitely Wendell. Did you ever hold a possum before? No. He's just perfect. I never thought he would be so big. He's kind of on a diet right now just because he's so large. done wonders for me to give and receive love from Wendell just sort of warmed my heart in a way that I can't really describe. They have such short lives. I think it's two to four years in captivity. It's rare to get them past two years. They're very fragile and they require such special care. Even though I enjoy each day with them, I already think about when they pass, it's gonna hit me really hard. He needs me and I need him.